Hey Planner Babes, it's Mandy and Honey from Create With Mandy and we're here to film a video for you today. I know we've been gone for a little while but we are back and ready to get back into it. I'm in my new studio, actually it's my mom's art room. So thanks much for joining us today and uh, let's go ahead and get planning. All right, planner babe, so let's go ahead and get into it. So I'm planning on my wellness planner, my first video back, back in a little while. Um, not too long, but just a little break there. And let's go ahead and show you last week. So this is the one, this is the last one that you guys saw me plan. And you know, I haven't filled it out all the way in the weekend yet, but I am gonna go back and do that. I had a chance to go in and add my Fitbit stats, so it's actually pretty, Pretty active this week, went on three different, uh, you know, runs, jogs, whatever. So that was really good and I'm excited to get back into that. I did cover up some of my journaling because it has been a little more personal lately and I need that. I need to be more personal than stuff that I can show you guys every week. So it might continue to be covered up, might be able to show you guys again, but yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, I just need to get back into it and use it in a daily way, but I'm still, you know, just trying my hardest, but you know, life happens, you know, can't get things done every week, but here we go. We're going to go ahead and plan a new week. Hopefully I can, uh, you know, get in a better routine this week and really leave it open on my desk and use it every day and not just have it closed, put away, forgotten about. So, I've got two books here that I want to use. I've got the My Garden sticker book from that Garden Be Happy box that came out a little bit ago. And I also have Trust the Process, which this is a wellness focused book. It's all perfect for a wellness planner. So I've also got my washi here because the color palette of these guys doesn't exactly match these three lines across the page. So I thought washi tape would be perfect for that. But I think I'm going to go ahead and do the washi like after I've put my stickers in. So we'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, so I'm thinking that my garden book will be used for some of the decorative elements because there's some really cute little illustrations in here that are adorable. Love the color palette. So I kind of want to use some of those. And then there's some more functional ones that I won't be able to use as much. There is that nice quote. I'm just kind of getting started here. I, I didn't pick them out. I didn't pick my stickers out beforehand, but we're just going for it. So I like this quote, but I know that there's some really good ones in here as well that are kind of similar style, these guys. They're a little bit more um, delicate looking. The font is a lot thinner. So I think I will stick with this and really just do the, the decorative elements from here. Alrighty. So I guess that means that I should go ahead and put in all my functional things first and then come back for the more decorative things. Besides a quote, I definitely wanted to grab a quote from here though. All right, let me go ahead and give myself some space. I guess let's take out the pages. Haven't done that. Alrighty, even more room now. Okay. So, like I said, this is a wellness focused book. So like all of these quotes are very fitting. I feel like I could just pick a random one and it would just work great, but it's okay to not, it's okay not to have it all figured out. Make sure you go easy on yourself. Be your own cheerleader. You are enough. The world needs what you've got. Balance is beautiful. You are capable of amazing things. I like this one a lot. Trust the timing of your life. And it's just like beautifully designed. It's got some cute star stickers around it or stars, doodles, you know, really, really cute. Okay. I would like to use that one. I almost want to put it with a box or something though because we've got lined pages but I don't know if I'll be able to find anything I guess before we even do that I had my eye on one of these long box stickers for the sidebar let's go ahead and grab this one it's got wellness goals action steps and reflection so let's go ahead and put that over here. I'm gonna cover up the little notes. There we go. 
and then maybe just kind of layer that over here and I'm not gonna press down all the way so I can cover up this red line and I don't know if you heard honey behind me but she's laying down in the chair right where I left her so so cute I guess she's gonna nap while we plan okay so I just read this quote it says take care of yourself first then there's work on you for you that one I, I kind of want to stick with this like light color palette so I'm thinking let's just go ahead and put this one here and as always, if this is your first time watching my wellness videos, let me just preface by, I do a lot of my decoration in the middle, my Fitbit stats go in the top, and my journaling in the bottom. And I like to keep it that way and leave as much room possible for the journaling because I tend to write a lot sometimes. So leaving all the room there. Okay. Alrighty, I'm thinking possibly one of these another one of these quotes and I'm kind of going with this pink color palette we've got some blue I do like this one it's okay not to have it all figured out it's a good one maybe over here directly in the middle or kind of offset I think I'll offset it so that way we can put in some more decorations and you know already I feel like this <laughs> this is one of the this is gonna be one of those spreads that you know is totally different than how I imagined but that's okay okay I'm gonna start flipping through the end I want to know what you guys use these monthly boxes for I guess a habit tracker but you'd have to go put it in the monthly section not sure haven't used any yet okay we've got some little mood stickers. Got pink. I got I guess I should grab some different colors, but it's alright. Why not? Let's put one there and then here, just kind of randomly putting those in. Okay, I love these um, little like script words some in gold this rose gold foil so we've got focus improvements victories reflect me time details and grateful for okay let's do a little focus I don't know I don't know my uh, intention for this but we'll just go ahead and put it down where do we want it I don't know I guess if I don't have a plan for it, I shouldn't be putting it down. But I mean, I think I can kind of write a little focus for the week. I think I think that would be good in the sidebar here. Yeah. Like I said, this one is already different than I imagined. <laughs> All right. Here's some good little like habit tracker type of words, but I'm just gonna leave those for now since I've pretty much filled up the whole sidebar. Here's some like prompts that you can add in, but again, I think I'm just gonna leave it blank. I might end up going to the my garden book for the rest of this spread, except maybe for some, some bullet points. So I think I might use some of those. That might be it. So let's go ahead and go over here try to add in some of these like deeper tones and not have so so much pink also got some good boxes in here so hopefully I can use a couple of those and I'll bring in some of those deeper tones I love these pattern boxes but I'm not I'm not sure yet okay let's go ahead and add some of these Maybe we should move away from that color. Let's do a green. Got a lot of pink over here, so just gonna try to balance it out. Kind of wanting to layer. And when I add these boxes in the middle, it's not really for any specific reason. If 
I do work out, then I'll have something to write it in. But if I don't, then that's okay too. But usually it ends up being all right. Okay, let's add one of these other dark boxes over here. And maybe one up here. I'm gonna layer it on top of this box and so I'll have to cover the quote a little bit so I'm gonna lift that up so I don't cover it all the way. And then I'll just have the quote coming on top of the box and you can still read it. Okay, now let's go find those cute little decorative elements. And I like the ones that are paper, these guys. Let's just double check. Some good habit trackers. And obviously I'm using this garden book in a way that's not for gardening. So there you go if you were, if you have it, but you were worried that you weren't gonna use it or something, there you go. Oh, look how cute that is. It's a little shelf of the plant, so I think it would be cute over top of there. I love this little like pendant decoration thing. What else? Cute little plant in a pot. Cute pot. Maybe another plant somewhere. I don't know. Hmm. Sure, why not? Usually I like to put them on top of something, but that one's okay, just sitting there. Add this one over here. Adorable. Okay, and I think there were a couple little ones. Yeah, right in here. Some gloves, scissors, this rainbow is adorable. Let's add that in. Okay, really cute. Different than how I imagined, but still cute. Now let's go ahead and add some of these. I always like to add these just to kind of note where I'm adding my Fitbit stats. It's totally unnecessary, but I just kind of like the look of it. And it's just kind of like a nice designation for where that's gonna go. Although I do need to probably pull it down one space because I'm gonna add washi. Maybe, maybe I won't add washi to this top line. I know, I just talk myself through these problems. Okay, I'm not gonna add it to the top line because it is kind of like a nice shade of like peachy pink, I don't know. So I'm gonna leave that one. But I think the red in the middle and the yellow can definitely be covered up. Okay, so I've got the washi from the Garden Be Happy box. It's right here. Some really cute ones, but I usually tend not to like the ones that have words on them, like as much. I don't know, just not my favorite. I like a patterned washi better. So let's see what we can use. I always like this dark one. I have always liked this one. Got some little pink plants, kind of like a bluish with some pink flowers on it and then a nice like mustardy yellow. All right, I'm liking this one. So let's just go for it. Gonna go ahead and just use my nail to cut it and have a raw edge there. The sky is over top of the rainbow, but I'm not minding that. And let's go ahead and see what we can do down here. I like it. And now for the one up here. I wonder if we should use a really skinny washi, which I don't have too many of them. I just got rid of a bunch because I never really use them. But let's see, how about just a nice black and white? There's not really much black and white though. Got this color, which is almost the same color as the line on the page. 
Um, gold. Might just end up using one of these thicker ones. Here's a nice like navy blue stripe, which I always liked, but it's a little dark. I'm thinking I've got to go for something a little lighter. So we're going to either do these plants or that. I'm thinking plants. That mustard was just a little too dark. So going for the plants. I haven't used this one very much, so excited to use it now. And of course I'm using it in a way that I usually don't, which is just lining it up across the lines on the page. I like to usually layer it, you know, with boxes and on top of things, but I like sometimes using it like this, so. There we go. You can see the red line through it, but I'm just gonna have to deal with that because I don't really care that much. Alrighty, I guess we'll go ahead and lift up this guy. Shouldn't be too hard. And now we're adding more of that plant theme, I guess. And we'll lift up this last one. Definitely an interesting combination. I don't hate it. But it's definitely not what I thought this was going to turn out like, but that's okay because, you know, they can't all be amazing, spectacular ones. But I'm sure some of you guys are still going to like it, even though I'm just like, eh. Definitely going to use it still, and that's what it's all about. Left myself room for that journaling. I'm excited to use one of these again. I haven't used, um, well, I just, I'm about to say I haven't used one of these things in the sidebar in a while, but this one's a little more wellness related, and I haven't used this sticker book in a while so that's where i'm coming from maybe in the next couple weeks depending depending on how this goes i might get a little more functional with these spreads and do more stuff in the sidebar and more like maybe habit trackers and stuff because habit tracker is something i haven't done in a while for sure so but it's been a busy uh month or two months so Maybe we're ready to get back into it and we'll see how it goes. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one. I will try to link these books below. As you know, the garden one might not be available, but there you go. I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you guys in my next videos. Bye guys.